And yes, Obodo Nigeria Lokpa Force, they don't parade about 27 suspected criminals plus kidnappers for inside Abuja. The first public relations officer, Frank Mbawani, in the summer worry on top of the and plenty of people the way down the day on top of this kidnap matter and other criminal activities. In summer, the public say make them be more security conscious and make them help they expose all these badness criminal elements with the inside the communities. A total of 70 of 27 suspects now in them being parade for different crime on top of arm robbery, kidnap matter, and plus say then get firearms we're not supposed to be inside uh, their load. There is a big kidnapper operating within the Opoku Otuko Obadibo Axis, known as Matthew Jerome. Matthew Jerome is a very dangerous kidnapper. Dangerous because he, he is camouflaging within his area as a youth leader and as a leader of the vigilante group. For traditional rulers, Presidents of town unions out there, local government chairmen, and other community leaders, it is important that we continue to pay very close attention to people in positions of authority, positions of responsibility. In most communities where the vigilante groups report directly to traditional rulers, work with um, divisional police officers, work with local government chairmen. It is important we continue to monitor them, continue to carry out constant background checks on them. Even those of us that, those of them we fought, are nice people who suddenly suffer a character mutation and become very dangerous people. And so, on our part, we'll continue to work with community leaders to ensure that persons like Matthew Jerome, who are clearly green snakes in green grass, are detected, isolated, neutralized, and brought to book. 